for. So we're actually getting kicked off. Yeah, sure. Crossbar, crossbar for a fiver. Crossbar for a fiver. Hashtag elbow it. <laughs> yeah, me a fiver. It's 5 p.m. here and it's hot. Really hot. Touch. <laughs> How are we doing, guys? Thanks for all the engagement on the last video. We really do appreciate it. We see all the comments, some great comments as well. I think this some great smoothie comments. Great smoothie comments. Yeah. This week's top comment choice is going to be tough, isn't it? Yeah. There's loads to pick from. I saw some good smoothies as well. So well done, guys. Appreciate it. <laughs> Little free kick sesh. We are going to throw some clips in from our mini six side games as well that we play with our mates. It's all good good fun, good laugh and that isn't it? So. Nice to be back to a bit of normality in that sense. Yeah, yeah, definitely. We missed it, haven't we? Oh but... yeah. We've all been tested negative for coronavirus, so it's all good. <laughs> Enjoy the content, hope you get some good goals and skills for you to see. Enjoy. How'd you do this? I can't, I can't put it back on the tree. I am fed up. That, that De Gea, the most overrated goalkeeper. No, okay. <laughs> Patrice, the most overrated goalkeeper I've seen in a long, Maybe, long time. Yeah. This, this is middle of the goal. I think it's a great, yeah, I, but I think a it's great a great save. save. You need to be ready. It's coming Patrice, quick. Is, if that is not a great save, that's, that's his job. No, I'd save this. Solid today. Well, I don't go that far from the holidays, and he scored. We've been here like five minutes, guys. And some guy in a pink shirt's been a bizard. Do you guys have trouble with people at your pitch kicking you off? Everything all right? Oh, was that a guy in the car? He runs the school. Yeah, we are. I had a good word with him. I spoke yeah, to him. Yeah, he shouldn't be here at all, as he said. Yes, yeah, we're just only three of us. I know. Oh, it's just so so annoying. Going there's there's no access to go because all goes down. Right? Yeah, no. Well, the same thing. Like, goals. if you don't want to see it, take it home. Yeah, so you will go with you tonight, anyway. Yeah, yeah, that's all right. right. Well, thank you for being. Yeah, you know, no, I've got no problem. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Don't worry. Cheers. Yeah. Thank you. What is the world coming to? Very rarely do we get mad, guys. Not mad as such, but just like... Frustration. Frustrated, yeah. Like we've got all ready for football. You know, it takes effort to do all that prep and that that you guys don't see. The vice principal, is it? He was on the phone to security about us. And I said to him, like, if you've got an issue, just come and speak to us, to our face, you know? Yeah. Don't... Well, he's getting other guys to do his dirty work, wasn't he? Yeah. Seriously. It's not an easy thing to do, and we respect people, you know, what they've got to do for work and that, but... It's past all that, it's not to cause any harm, we're just playing football and just let us, leave us to it. Leave us to it. The problem we have as well, guys, is that it's a time of year where there's no goals up anyway. So it's a real struggle finding a goal and we can't use the 3G because they're still locked and shut because of lockdown. So we're trying somewhere else and it's just like last resort. So let's see how we get on. Good news, guys. We found a goal. It's been about almost an hour since we got kicked off the last pitch 50 minutes to be precise 
gonna get the video done here. So today's video is a flat ball experiment. A lot of people say, oh, the ball's only knuckleballing or moving in because the ball's flat, as in not pumped up fully. We're gonna test that theory today. There's Ozil. <laughs> Littering. <laughs> Typical. So what's the corner that we're shooting at? Where there's no pegs, like this. To hook the net on. So tape it is. So due to the circumstance of the pitch, Sammy is not risking the official match ball. So we are going to use the two cheap Nike footballs we've got with us. It's still a fair test, and you guys have more chances of getting our footballs anyway. So it yeah. makes it more real in that sense. Shout out to those lads that recognise us as PK17. Obviously not on camera, but. So we're letting air out the football guys. Obviously we want it to be flat and but not too flat so you can't obviously strike it. And this is as flat as we're gonna have it. Obviously if it's too flat, then you won't even be able to kick it. So look at you can see by the creases in the ball how flat, flat it is. And what we'll do, I'll do five shots with it like this, and then pump it up straight after, and then test it to see if it makes a difference. I still believe it's going to be easier when it's more pumped up, but you guys, some of you think otherwise, so not our loyal subscribers. Normally people that are random comment on the video saying, oh, a knuckleball only works when it's flat, so let's see if it works when it's flat. It's probably worth mentioning that this is how our GoPro is set up today. Obviously, normally we use a case of some sort, but they're all broken, so <laughs> we've got to make do with that. Let's go. There we go, first shot. With the flat ball. Another thing we should probably mention <laughs> is the state of this to get the football back. Them forms and they're so sharp. That was my first shot as well. <laughs> oh, it's gonna take up so much time. Not gonna lie guys, I'm actually quite surprised by that. I feel like I'm gonna be eating my own words. It's a weird one because obviously it's... Oh no. Look how sharp that is. Is that punctured? It's not hissing yet. That's exactly why we're not using the match balls. <laughs> it's why we don't come to this pitch. <laughs> exactly that. I am surprised with the movement. That's my first five shots and you can see it moving, still getting knuckleball effects. It does feel weird to strike. It feels really spongy and soft, so it doesn't feel natural at all, which is quite a nice feeling because it does obviously show to you guys that we don't ever shoot with flat footballs. It always pumps up. So now we're going to test that. We're going to pump the ball back up and have five shots with it fully inflated. So obviously the, the ball was pumped up and now I'm going to pump up the football. Yeah, obviously, I'm uh, going to score uh, some penalties because I'm Harry Kane and I, I only score penalties and I claim goals that aren't my own goals, uh, <laughs> obviously. <laughs> but anyway, <laughs> I can't see obviously now. It's not my go-to word. Pumping up now, guys. <laughs> There's no giving that at all. You can clearly see. But it doesn't, doesn't prove anything anyway, does it? Because the grass is like... Yeah, you, can, you can hear the fact that it's... <laughs> it's like, hey, these are my kickbacks. Hey. Yeah, the, the, the sound difference is yeah, you obviously can tell. really clear. So this is the first shot of five with the ball pumped up. Got like two keepers behind the goal. So there we go guys, five 
knuckleball free kicks with a flat football and five with one rock solid. For those of you guys that still think it's better to knuckleball with a flat ball, hopefully we've kind of proved that it's not. Yes, it moves if it's flat. No, we don't use flat footballs, so there's your answer. Yeah, perfect summary. It's annoying because I've got it in me to have another hour, two hours shooting free kicks and we've I'm, got to stop. I'm hungry as well. Well, it is dinner time, so. Oh, it's just so annoying. Stolen boy. Mate, I'm tired and hungry. You guys Stolen are very lucky you've got boy. me. So we're leaving the pitch now. Dad. Dad's <laughs> taking us home. <laughs> Honestly, <laughs> legit feel like the parents, mate. Ah! To be fair, I would have stayed another hour if it wasn't thanks to Charlie. Going home. He's like, oh no, I've got to go home now. Dinner's ready. Oh, fine. Okay, Dad. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hope you enjoyed the match footage that we were thrown in during this video at some point. That was from two separate matches. So hope you enjoyed it. I'm sure you'll be able to work that out yourselves. Let us know in the comments if you're going to test this theory out yourself. If you're going to maybe go to the field and have a few shots with a flat football and then pump it up and have a few shots with obviously a fully inflated football and see the difference yourself because you've seen our video. Hopefully it's inspired you to do some kind of experiments yourselves. Top comments you'll see now. Thank you so much again for all the feedback in our most recent video. It was on point guys, you're all legends. We really appreciate it. See you next time. Knuckle it, elbow it. We're still doing it, elbow it. Just remember